the health sector has received 121.1 billion shillings in the 2021-2022 financial year. This is an increase from last year's allocation of 114 billion shillings. In this allocation, 0.4% will be utilized in propelling universal health coverage towards actualization, with the main aim being to improve access to affordable health care. A lot remains to be done in order to deal with the challenges of unemployment among our youth, as well as high, high poverty and income equality levels that have been aggravated by the COVID-19 pandemic. The plight of the vulnerable in our society, particularly the emerging urban vulnerable, remains a key concern for our government. In order to cushion this particular group, the government will announce cash transfer allocations and institute other targeted interventions in this budget. The COVID-19 vaccinated population is likely to increase further in the second half of 2021 as 14.3 billion shillings has been set aside to finance the purchase and delivery of the COVID-19 vaccine. In order to facilitate further rollout of vaccines to create herd immunity, we propose to allocate Kenya shilling 14.3 billion in the financial 2021-22. This is in addition to Kenya shilling 7.6 billion appropriated in the current budget. In the event of an emergency related to COVID-19, however, 8.7 billion shillings has been allocated for the rehabilitation program. This attention has well been distributed to other diseases as well. The lower cases of HIV, AIDS, ma and malaria, and tuberculosis in the country, Kenya shilling 5.8 billion has been set aside. To enhance vaccines and immunization program, we've set aside Kenya shilling 3.9 billion. Shortage of health personnel alongside scarcity of medicinal drugs has also been taken into account in the 2021-2022 budget. Ben Kerera K24, Evening Edition.